Всем привет! I'm just kidding. I just finished my Russian class. So welcome back to quarantine vlog number six. Um, last week I kept last week I kept saying number four, but I was actually number five. This is number six. Um, I know I was talking about in our last vlog that we were going to get an announcement on like quarantine and stuff. So we got that announcement, and basically, there, um, they announced that lockdown will be broken up into phases of like reintegration blah 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 um starting 18th of may however salons are not deemed an essential service and also deemed more of a also deemed of a higher risk bracket due to being like in close contact with clients and that kind of stuff so they were proposing like 20th of July to go back to work and for tattoo artists and piercers like 10th of August. So that's going to be fun. Um, tonight in like 10-15 minutes we have another family quiz and I am actually hosting it with my sister. We made, actually I did everything, she's literally just going to like tell the answers or the questions or something. Um, we did a quiz of like general knowledge so you're gonna hear next week how we got on with that and um, actually I want to show um one thing my mom sent me like a random um present it's from a brand in Dublin called the kind sustainable lifestyle store 16 Fade Street Dublin 2 obviously they're closed at the minute but my mom was able to order online and she ordered some pretty cool stuff. We got a scour made from coconut. I don't know how many other vegans watch these videos, but if you're vegan, please let me know if you literally rely on coconuts for everything. Coconut milk, coconut oil, coconut flour, <laughs> coconut sugar. I'm going to turn it into a coconut. And then we also got some mats, like uh, coasters made from cork and plastic from oceans which is very cute then a toothpaste charcoal activated or activated charcoal toothpaste and it's in a glass jar so obviously that's recyclable and then one of the one of the more exciting things is the natural deodorant the brand is pit putty and there's one rose geranium and cinnamon and cedar wood whenever you move or switch to a natural deodorant you do need to give your body time to adjust to it so this is probably the best time to do it so i'm going to try and get me and stanny onto that like this week and then i got a glass we'll do some asmr a glass squeezy bottle with some cleaning solution sachets and they come with little stickers and they come like this with the soap inside and apparently like um, the instructions say that you just mix it in the bottle with warm water and it dissolves and then obviously you're not wasting plastic getting different bottles and stuff so i'm very excited to try that um it's really nice to know there is a super sustainable brand in dublin um be very excited to go check out the actual store whenever we are out of isolation and the uh, pit putties smell really really nice which I haven't even tried it wow yeah so that was one thing I wanted to show and it's always nice to get a, a, a present in the mail what have I been up to the same week it's every single everything's the same not really a lot um done more stuff like business wise with the training manual I have also I had some requests in to start doing strip lashes for my clients what else have we been up to we've been going on lots of walks I've been trying to get up in the morning to go for a walk only if it's sunny I'm not gonna go if it's rainy or cloudy also oh my god I made cinnamon rolls I'm gonna see if the picture is gonna load not really, but I made it with short crust pastry and Stanny said it was fine, but it was not actually that good. I didn't really thought it could have been a lot better. 
my psoriasis is like out of control at the minute or like all over my body so that's really really itchy and like annoying and sore um if anyone has psoriasis my sister is dealing with the same stuff at the minute i think it's like exasperated by being stressed but psoriasis is not fun i don't know if you can can't really see it but i've got it here as well and i've been trying to upload i have like loads and loads and loads of pictures of lashes on my phone try to go through and like edit and upload them that's about it i did take a very sad I did take a very sad blog clip um, whenever we had the announcement on about the like the extending of lockdown I had like my phone recording me like this it just my reaction when he said 18th of May and I was like fuck fuck because <laughs> I had um I'm in different groups and stuff on Facebook of other lash techs and other like estheticians beauticians and obviously in America they are being quite lax um, relaxing the restrictions like I know some places they didn't really have anything that strict to begin with um, maybe because the states or whatever didn't have a lot of cases but um, some other sounds like in countries in Europe like Portugal someone in Spain a lot more of those countries are going back well slowly going back to normal whereas here in Ireland we are being quite um, cautious so I don't know what's gonna happen with that I don't really, really want to say anything about it because obviously everyone has like their own opinion but I am very excited to get back to normal life whenever we can um, but we have to wait and see I guess at least we have nice weather at the minute it does look nice for like the rest of the week so that's good Um, one thing we were do well one thing I've been doing a lot is playing sims I well, we downloaded the sims island living and I'm obsessed but I love The Sims, it's so much fun. So I'm doing like my dream house <laughs> that I'm gonna live in in the Maldives. And as well, I've been looking at like different apartments and stuff in Odessa, just like manifesting this fucking quarantine, being over, get out to work, saving money and moving from Dublin at some point. And um, different stuff like that. Also, as I was saying in my past, videos we've been playing a lot of GTA and we like we finally figured out like a very good way to make money and we want to do like <laughs> we see all these videos on YouTube of like people saying like oh this is the best way to make money in GTA and they have like 15 million views so it's like oh my god starting we have to do one um I would fucking die though like just looking at the other videos on my channel and then just going to be like a random like how to make 300,000 GTA dollars in five minutes just shit like that so if that comes please like and uh, leave a comment I think that's about it I need to quickly call my sister and run through the questions and make sure I think I'm reading the questions and she reads she's reading the answers um, but we need to figure out who's gonna keep track. Also, I wanted to make Stanny watch. You know how I made him watch Lost. I want him to. I want to make him watch Twenty Four, my like ultimate favorite. But I can't find it anywhere. It's so annoying. I can't find it anywhere to show him. Like it's not on Amazon Prime. It's not on Netflix. And we use the PlayStation to like watch TV. So I don't know if you can like illegally stream it <laughs> on the playstation anyways i'm gonna go this vlog is at 11 minutes by the time i cut out all the clips with me like burping <laughs> it's gonna be less than that so i'm gonna go basically is what i'm saying um thanks for watching my videos i'm gonna be here next week for quarantine vlog number six and apparently a lot more after that so we'll keep them going I'll try and do something interesting in the meantime. Tomorrow I will walk to my salon. Stanny also said, I make him watch my vlogs after I upload them. He also said like, why do you always say bye and then you keep talking for like five minutes? And I was like, shut up. <laughs> Tomorrow I'm going to my salon to get um, just some more like lashes and stuff so I can do these strip lashes. And I also need to grab, I kind of want to take some things out of there because I'm going to, not be there for a long time just like maybe more expensive things I don't really want to leave there um 
and it'll be nice to go for a walk. Obviously, the kilometers were extended where you can walk from, so we, we might even cycle, but we'll, we'll walk. I also am really, cra cr uh, really craving kvashnai kapusta, which is basically like sauerkraut, and I really like the one from the Polonaise or Moldovian shop. It's really good. So we're going to do that tomorrow. And yeah, that's basically it. Toodaloo. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.